now to a developing story. Iran launched a ballistic missile attack on Israel today, marking a significant escalation in the widening conflict in the Middle East. The strike follows Israel's ground invasion into Lebanon and an Israeli airstrike over the weekend, which killed the leader of the Iran-backed militia group Hezbollah. Here in Houston, security measures are in place across the city after the missile attack on Israel. KPRC2 reporter Corley Peel joins us live now. She's outside the Jewish Federation of Greater Houston, where they are focusing on safety tonight. Corley. Keith, the Jewish Federation says it has not received direct attacks or any threats after those bombings in Israel today. Now, HPD, they are amping up security by adding patrols near synagogues and mosques throughout the city. But take a look at this video. This is from earlier this afternoon, the moment when Iran launched a missile attack on Israel. I did have a chance to sit down with the Jewish Federation president and CEO, Rene Wizik Barrios, who said, says, although they are not having a vigil tonight, tomorrow starts Rosh Hashanah, the Jewish New Year. She says safety, bringing the community together and providing resources is a priority. It's a very sacred time of year and people really want to have hope for peace and for better times. We have a, a Jewish community security initiative uh, and our security director, Al Tribble, leads that. We have provided a lot of training to all of our synagogues and help them assess the needs that they have for security. So everyone has made their own security plans and I believe that they have been made understanding the context of what we're facing today. So we think it is very safe for people to go and worship, that they will be protected, that the measures are in place to ensure that that can happen in a peaceful way. Now, KPRC2 also received a statement from a spokesperson for the Iranian-American community in Houston, Donya Zirasak. Zarek Sari says in part, Dear Houston, in these challenging times, it is more important than ever for our diverse Houston community to come together with empathy, compassion, and understanding. We are blessed to be home to people with all faiths who contribute to the rich tapestry that makes Houston strong. And let us choose love over hate, peace over violence, and unity over division. Now you can see her full statement on our website at click2houston.com. But next week marks one year since the October 7th attacks and the Jewish Federation plans to hold a vigil on Monday. Reporting live from Ireland, Corley Peel, KPRC 2 News.